Hi, I'm Laura for Poker News with your daily update on what's happening right here at the World Series of Poker in Las Vegas. Day 11 of the series saw one more action-packed event get very close to crowning a champion. However, at 3 a.m. the heads-up in the 2500 mixed triple draw low ball was still in play, so the duo agreed to continue the battle later on today instead. Meanwhile elsewhere, we did find a winner. It took just over 12 hours for WSOP.com reg Pete Chen to overcome a 1,023 player field and claim his first WSOP gold bracelet in the online event. Chen defeated Sylvester 7 heads up in the No Limit Hold'em Ultra Deep Stack, taking home $82,559 for his efforts. Some of the events still in play include the 10K 7 Card Stud Championship, where Phil Helmuth has bagged yet another stack in a non Hold'em event, where he is currently standing as chip leader. The self-proclaimed poker brat has been banging on the door of bracelet number 16 all series with three caches including two final tables already in mixed game events. The finalists return today at 3pm. Day 2 of the Millionaire Maker saw the Day 2 field whittle down to 170, all of whom are safely in the money. Daryl Ronconi is the chip leader going into Day 3, armed with 2.5 million in chips. Incredibly, Ronconi was down to only 10 big blinds on the money bubble and not only survived but bounced back later in the day to claim the overall chip lead. Plenty of talented players are still in the mix in this event, including Vanessa Cade with just over 1.5 million and former main event champion Ryan Reese bagging 540,000. The 1K Flip and Go event was a roaring success with 1,232 players buying in. Those who won the flip at the start of the day progressed to day two in the money, having locked up $2,000. With only 23 players remaining, the min cash is now $7,275,000. Play resumes at 1 p.m. today, and they play until a winner is crowned. And finally, Scott Abrams is leading the 1500 mixed Omaha High Low as it moves into today at 2 p.m., with 199 surviving the day, down from 640 entrants. Other names to watch here are Gigi Poker Ambassador Daniel Negranu, Brian Hastings and Eric Cizel. As for today, we will see the women out in force with the ladies No Limit Hold'em Championship beginning at 11am. This is a four day event with one entry per player allowed. The 1500 eight game mix six handed will also be held today with the start time a little later at 3pm. And that's all for now, but stay tuned to Poker News to follow along as the day progresses. Our coverage of the WSOP is powered by Club GG.